parliamentary registration officials encouraging Bahamians to take advantage of the lull and beat the voter registration rush. Good evening, everyone. I'm Keisha Adderley. And I'm Charisma Robinson. A surprisingly low number of people have registered to vote, even though we are months away from the 2017 general election. Janae Noel Ferguson has a breakdown of the numbers as compared to the same period five years ago. In September 2011, just eight months before the 2012 general elections, close to 100,000 persons had registered to vote. Fast forward five years later during the same period now in 2016, that number stands at a mere 52,000 votes. Although the low numbers at this point could be seen as an indication that the major parties have not excited their base supporters to register and vote or a lack of enthusiasm for the next general election, Parliamentary Commissioner Sherlyn Hall says while he's not in a position to analyze the reason for the low voter registration, when compared to previous years, a number of contributing factors are likely. It is unusual. Um... I don't want to speculate why. You know, we just came out of a referendum. Uh, in 2011, we had no referendum. So if you want to look at what transpired during those years, this year we had a referendum. And whether that played a is playing a factor, I can't say. But um, it is rather low. And um, uh, we are concerned. He gave this breakdown of the numbers and reminded persons of the documents needed to register. The numbers compared to when we started, uh, in, in um, 2011, the numbers as of this October comparatively low. I would say around about 55% of what we had in 2011. Um, persons who registered before simply need to bring their 2012 card. Um, we would accommodate you. Um, we check the system to see what you used when you first registered. And once you presented the correct documents in the first case, you will accept your 2012 cards to prove that you're a Bahamian citizen. Hall added that the low numbers could also impact the job of the Boundaries Commission as they meet to decide on the boundaries and how they will be divided for the upcoming election. He noted, however, that no registration number for various constituencies is set in stone. It does not speak to no particular law. It just says that um, all of the numbers of registered voters in each polling division should be around about 400 plus, okay? Um, so my job is to, the Boundaries Commission job is to look at the numbers we have, but ask um, from that, decide to shift polling divisions to, com to, to make sure there's an equal balance for all polling divisions with number no more than four or 500 persons. Again, the Boundary Commission has uh, jurisdiction to shift boundaries, whether they have numbers or not. But traditionally, as, as I said, and there's no legal requirement for that number to be achieved so they can make decisions as they see fit. Voter registration drive continues from 10 to 4 at NIB headquarters daily. Also at the mall at Marathon, the Elizabeth Estate, South Beach, Cable Beach, and Carmichael Road post offices. Janae Noel Ferguson, ZNES Network News.